Men are now jumping on the bandwagon. In fact, male plastic surgery procedures make up 13% of all plastic surgeries in the U.S. That's a 5% increase in the last year and a half alone. And it's not always easy to get women to fess up, but we did find some guys to tell all. This was 59-year-old David Culpepper just six months ago. This is David today. So I had a facelift and a chin implant. The Virginia Beach resident made the decision to go under the knife after a conversation with his fiancée, Cindy, a few months before their wedding. I lost a lot of weight and the skin was sagging on me. People started to say, you look more like your dad every day. <laughs> I think the barrier for plastic surgery has been lowered considerably. Men just want to look better in general. It's not just for women anymore. Plastic surgeons like Dr. David Hidalgo, who performed David Culpepper's surgeries, stress that facial work on men can be trickier than on their female counterparts. The structures are bigger, the skin is thicker, it generally takes a lot longer to do the surgery. But for David, the recovery time was well worth it. When I see myself now, uh, okay, you look good, it feels good. And Cindy, who is now his wife, couldn't agree more. Oh, he's so handsome. He, uh, he always had this beautiful smile, and now with his new jawline, he's extremely handsome. So, if you know a guy who looks amazingly refreshed, consider this. According to the Wall Street Journal, almost 1.2 million men had a little something done in the last year. One of the reasons is improving technology. Men are more comfortable with the idea of plastic surgery because the recovery time is more predictable. And Dr. Hidalgo says, in our youth-obsessed culture, men want to remain competitive in the workplace.